This is a series of tutorials on how to use Google Sites. In this tutorial, you will learn how to navigate to Google Sites and how to create a brand new website. So let's get started. The first thing you're going to do is pull up the internet and go to google.com. So I'm using Mozilla Firefox. I'm just going to type in as my URL, www.google.com. Now from Google's main page, you'll see at least two ways to get to Google Sites. The first way would be to go to the More column, click on the arrow, and you'll see Sites down here at the very bottom. But what I'm going to do is go into my search field, and I'm going to actually search for Google Sites. Hit Enter, and you'll see the uppermost thing that we found is Google Sites. And so I'm going to click on that, and that'll take me to the main page for Google Sites. Now you've seen in previous tutorials how to set up a Google account and you'll need that Google account to create this website. So I'm going to go ahead and sign in with mine. And I'm on a private, I'm on a public computer actually, so I'm not going to check this box to remember me. But if this was my personal one, I probably would. I'm going to go ahead and sign in. And this takes me to the main page for Google Sites. What I want to do is create a brand new one, so I'm going to click on the box here. And that brings me to the main page. Now this is really simple. This is the only page you're going to have to enter information on to create your new site. So the first site just wants a name for the site. I'm going to call it My Biology Class. And you'll see that automatically puts it down here as the URL. I'm going to describe it just as education. Let me use this for my high school biology class. I'm not going to check mature content because this is not intended for solely adults. But I am going to select to share this only with people I specify. And what that means is I'm going to share this just with the folks in my classroom. When they all set up their Google accounts, we can make kind of a virtual classroom that only the students and myself will have access to. And this will be a great place for discussions, to post content, and just to be able to use it. So the last thing I need to do is create a, select a theme. I clicked on more themes because I wanted to see more options. I'm going to click on Horizon. That one looks good to me. So the last thing I need to do is type in the code I see here. This can be difficult sometimes. Once you've done that, hit Create Site. And it didn't like that, um, so it gave me a new one. And I think that's close. I'm going to hit Create Site. And, oh, it's t telling me that that site has already been taken. So I need to put in a new, a new name. So let's just call it Biology Class. Scroll back down. It already has my code typed in, so I'm going to hit Create Site. And that should take me right here to my brand new site. It's just that simple. Now in the next tutorial, you will learn how to edit this page if you want to change the name of it, if you want to add anything to it. If you want to create a new page, you'll learn that in the next tutorial. If you want to change the appearance, that will be in other future tutorials as well. So in this tutorial, we've gone over how to navigate to Google Sites and how to create a brand new website. It's a really great technology and really simple to use.